In 2019, a photo of a park ranger in the Congo went viral worldwide. The ranger had taken a stunning photo of himself with his gorilla friends that he cared for. An award-winning weather reporter for an Atlanta TV news station got in trouble for making an on-air remark about the photo. Ella Dorsey said, quote, Isn't it amazing? You can see the similarities between the ranger and them, end quote. Dorsey was accused of subliminal racism and was nearly fired. She later apologized via Twitter. Dorsey kept her job, but did get shuffled around in the lineup. Also in 2019, a white anchor lady for an Oklahoma City TV morning show, Houston and Hackett, got in trouble for an on-air comment about her co-host. In a segment on a gorilla named Finn in the Oklahoma City Zoo, Houston chided her friend Hackett, quote, he looks like you, end quote. She immediately lost her morning spot. Months later, she was quietly let go from the station. Eventually, she had to move to Texas. In July 2024, a British comedian referred to a top conservative politician as a quote-unquote chimpanzee. Jonathan Pye tweeted out that the race for the Tory leadership in Parliament was about to become a chimp fest. From the Irish Times, July 2024, Tom Walker rose to fame ranting about politics as a fictitious news reporter, Jonathan Pye. Continuing, Walker has more than 1.7 million followers on Facebook and some 900,000 followers on YouTube, some of his videos earning millions of views. The tweet read as follows, the battle for conservative party leadership has commenced. Continuing, now we get to observe them all throwing excrement at each other like a bunch of chimps in a zoo for the next three months. Walker might have been unaware that the three top candidates for the Tory position were people of color, or it might have been a simple case of subliminal stereotyping. Distinguished Tory Members of Parliament James Cleverly is a former British Army officer. He served as Home Secretary in the Conservative government under Theresa May. Kemi Badenoch has been a Tory MP for Essex since 2017. Suella Braverman is also an MP and served as Home Secretary in 2022. Both Bodenek and Braverman are staunchly conservative. Carl Benjamin is a popular muckracking conservative pundit. He has 407,000 followers on Twitter. Benjamin is also a longtime friend and ally of Reform Party leader Nigel Farage. Benjamin called Pi out on his hypocrisy. Quote, you called the diverse leadership of the Tories cleverly Badenoch chimps, John, end quote. Pi retorted, accusing Benjamin of trolling for clicks. Quote, do you earn extra money when you act like a child, end quote. Pi was a supporter of hard left Labor Party leader, Jeremy Corbyn. In a 2018 video, he said, quote, to me, socialism isn't an effing insult. Socialism recognizes the state needs to step in. It's not communism, it's compromise, end quote. He continued, quote, 
Socialism is the NHS. It's the welfare state. Socialism is helping people. That's the point. We are a socialist country and we just don't know it, end quote. Since the initial flurry of tweets, there have been no further communications between the two. Silence at the BBC. There has been no reporting in the mainstream media of Pi's chimpanzee remarks. This includes the BBC where Pi is employed. In 2019, another comedian at the network was canned for a similar chimpanzee comparison. Danny Baker tweeted out a photo of a royal couple with a baby chimpanzee, meant to playfully mock Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's mixed-race son, Archie. The BBC acted swiftly. Baker begged the BBC higher-ups to keep his job. He was forced to grovel, saying, quote, It was a genuine, naive, and catastrophic mistake, end quote. But Baker was fired anyway. Unlike other media figures and celebrities in the past who have referred to Afro-ethnics as primates, Walker has kept his job with the BBC. Jonathan Pye, Walker, just completed a comedy tour across the UK. He is expected to announce further dates in the UK and possibly the US for the fall. Thank you for watching. We strive to provide a good mix of paleoanthropology and politics at this channel. We always appreciate your feedback in the comments section. See you soon.